Hey Magus, Dark Fate here. Um, so this whole thing on uh, six days and what is it, Fallujah or Yeah, uh no, I don't think it's controversial at all. Um I have a sister that's in I that's well she's in the war. Uh she's a military interrogator, so I can't you can't really say where she is since it's against the their stuff, I mean she'd get in trouble. So anyway, um yeah, I mean they it's it's a double standard. I mean think of it this way. They make movies every fucking year about the Iraqi war and about things like the war in Iraq and Afghanistan and all that, yet when they make a video game about it because you're playing as somebody in it, it somehow becomes like it's like it's horrible, like there can't be anything like this. It's it's a, it's fucking ridiculous. I mean, if they're gonna do that, they might as well make make it so that they can't make any movies about it. There can't be any songs about it. There can't be any any form of video about it. I mean, it's it's retarded. Um, it's video putting it in a video game is just another way of getting the story out there to people. I mean, I a lot of people may not even know what it is, what it was. And I think it's, it's a good medium to be able to see what, what these soldiers went through in this conflict and see what the story actually was. And it actually is, can be an educational device, in a sense. I mean, I don't see how at all this could be um, a bad thing or even, like, something that shouldn't be made. I think it's kind of a cool idea to be able to um, educate people, in a sense, about some of the things that are happening overseas that they might be ignorant to knowing about. Um... Yeah, so, I mean, I guess some people, I guess I could see where they're coming from that it might be kind of soon to be doing it, but at the same time, um, it's, in a sense, it's best to do it while it's still going on because it'll still have interest in it, um, and there'll still be emotional value to it, while as something like, um, like how you mentioned World War II games, yeah, it was a horrible thing, um, yeah, it was a horrible thing, but think of it this way. If they had video games back in then, and they were releasing those kind of games right then, it would be a lot more emotionally connected to the people than it would be now to kids that are playing it now who really they just play it to play it. I mean, they don't really care. Um, so I think it's kind of cool that they're releasing it around this time. It gives a it gives some new insight on the war. Hopefully it, hopefully it's good, and hopefully they don't butcher it or, any, or anything or demoralize the soldiers and the things that they did for it. But, yeah, I mean, I think it should be made. I think that there should be more things like this. I think there should be more uh, mediums to express um, people's insights on the war. So, no, I don't think it's a bad thing. I have family in the war, so, I mean, if I thought it was a bad thing, I would say so. So, I say no. I think it's a good idea. I think that they should do more things like this.